Good morning, dudes, and welcome back to a little bit more of Project Dam. Look, I just felt like playing some more of this. It's really fun. This has to be my... Actually, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, no, no. What am I talking about? It definitely is my favorite game. I mean, come on. This shit is awesome. So let's just go for some more of it. Still terrible. Still trying my hardest. Still probably won't be able to commentate that well. So. Oh, look at that. Haha, <laughs> the reeds. Oh! <laughs> oh man, that was cool. Come on, come on, that was neat. Oh. Well, I suppose that works just fine for me. Uh, that's actually funny. If somebody's right beneath you, while you are on a, on a platform, and you do this, wait, you do the pillar, then you actually stay on the platform. It's weird like that. Oh! <laughs> oh, what the hell was that? The double dash attack into the shine, into the down smash. Get on that level. Um, nope. Okay, we're taking a lot of damage here, but I think we're doing just fine. Okay, up into the air. He never tacks the down throw. I'm gonna keep abusing that until he finally starts doing it. Look, if he starts tacking the down throw, then I will stop comboing it with the shine. But until he does, th does that, I'm gonna keep going. Oh, I love Gumi Race. That music is so cool. The Brawl version is even better. Nope. Oh, shit. Nope, taking so much damage right here. Okay, then. So we should try to avoid being offstage. Falco's offstage game is atrocious. But as long as we're on the stage, we should really be fine. The nice thing about Dreamland is that it's actually a really large stage. So, you tend to be able to, you know, kind of just chill on here forever. Even into very high percentages. And up smash probably won't even be able to kill us at this point. Because this stage... Okay, okay, I, I guess, I guess it would kill us. Uh, I forgot we're talking about Fox here. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Those dash attacks are actually really useful. I don't know if it's just because we are awful, but maybe, maybe they're just really... Look at this. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Grabs. Oh, bad news. Okay, got him with the get, atta get up attack. <laughs> down smash into another down smash. Get out of here! This is the problem with uh, Fox. He's actually not that tall. You must be this tall to get hit by a laser. Yeah, no, I need to I need to time my laser better. To be able to hit him with that all the time. Are we just doing this now? Because I'm perfectly fine with that. Oh, that should do it. Yeah, there's no way. You need to DI that. If you don't, then you will die. Nope. <laughs> oh, 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 bad news. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, that should do it. Damn it. Wasted my, wasted my air jump. Mm -hmm. 
Just poking him. And... Oh, no! Where are you going? Get back here! Actually, no. Don't get back here. Bulls, don't get back here. Why did I tell you to do that? Oh, there's nobody to blame for this one. I would have myself. Oh, no. Nope, 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 nope. Shouldn't have told them to get back here. Oh, nice. Okay, that should that should lead into something, right? Nope! Oh, bad news. Okay. Oh, oh, this is nice, however. Okay, toss him over there. Ah! <laughs> that does the trick. Okay, fantastic. Ooh, wow. Damn it, now I've got to play against Ness. I hate Ness. We don't have a safe state, like we always start anew, so... These characters, they always pop up and we always have to play against them. And I've got it already figured out. It's easy, man. It's easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. <laughs> I actually like the first Pokemon Stadium map. I think it's really fun. With the transformations and everything. What's he doing? Oh. Apparently dad. Damn it. Oh, wow. Okay. Nope, nope. Look at him! Shining my laser! <laughs> that is so cute. Damn it. I should not be using the forward area. The Flutterhush is not really that great. But it's got a funny name, Flutterhush. Okay. We got, in, we got him in the air. And now we just need to wave him, like we just don't care. Oh no! Wait, what? Seems we care too much. Oh, there you go, buddy. <laughs> yeah, we might have cared a little. I always like those moments where it's just both people do the same thing. No! Damn it! I wasn't sure how far his illusion was gonna reach and then I did nothing! Why did I do nothing? Could have at least tried for uh, something, you know? Here we go, that's better! <laughs> Sweet. We're using far too many roles. Like, what you always tell people, like, if they first start learning um, Smash, is forget everything about your roles. And we are using them constantly to move around. But that's actually not necessarily a bad thing, because in Smash 4, it seems that roles are gonna be really the way to go about it. There's no wave dashing in that. Honestly, wave, da wave dashing is actually only in Project M and Melee. So, which I guess Project M is no official Smash game. It's still the most fun. Oops. Damn it! That was not intentional. <laughs> but I'm actually super excited for Smash 4. I'm definitely gonna get it for the 3DS. I do not own a Wii U and I'm not entirely sure if I'm gonna buy one by the time Smash 4 comes out, but if anything is gonna get me to do it, that will be it, so. Uh, I hit him out of, out of his illusion, which is something I can only... I only rarely manage to pull off. I always try for it, but I never can do it. Oh, damn it! He was actually dead. He used an illusion. 
Well, I guess I saved him from an attack arrow. Killing somebody through attack arrow is kind of lame. You know, if, if, if this was in a tournament or something, I would totally take it and be happy. But right here, I'm just looking to play a bit. And then, I don't know. I don't really care that much. If I save him. Damn it! He got me with that one. That's one of the great things about Fox. He's got so many amazing kill moves. Falco too. Falco got quite a bunch of them, but not as many as Fox does. But it's very rare for a character to have as many kill moves as Fox does. <laughs> Honestly. Boom! <laughs> yeah, let's just pretend that it was intentional. Oh, there we go. That's good. Oh, man. If he had gotten that... Fox's recovery is really strong. It's still weak sauce compared to some other characters, but... Man, it's so good. Compared to Falco's, because Falco's is just awful. <laughs> No! Well, that was kind of... <laughs> no! <laughs> I power shielded that laser. Damn it. Don't make me so proud I killed myself. Oh, nice. I can keep forward smashing all day. Damn it! Maybe I can't. Yes, I can! <laughs> Okay, we got that. Let's keep going. Let's keep the chain going. Never stop. Oh, bad news. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, no, 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 we're still alive and we should be able to make it back. Maybe. He always, he always uh, rolls away. Like, that's what, that's his kind of, like, strategy to get away from me. So if I get him knocked to the ground, he will roll away. I just need to be quick enough to catch up. Oh, that's gonna do it. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, this is why you need to attack. If he had attacked that, he would have been just fine. Oh, it's Mashville. I lost Mashville. Partially because of the music. Nah, I think it's a really cool stage. Damn it. Oh, did you see that? That was a double shine. You can't... If you do it in rapid succession, you can stay on the ground. But I'm not quick enough. My fingers just... I don't... Can't... Did you see that? Doesn't actually consume your jump. You just kind of stay on the ground. It's really difficult to do. But they are like... You wouldn't believe it what some players can do in this game. And maybe, I, th I think they're, like, there's this player hacks, and he, uh, he, it's been going around that he, I think he actually did it on a stream, where he did, like, 60 or something s shines in a row, before ever leaving the ground. That's gotta be, like, a world record or something, you know. Boom. Nope. Not making it back from that one. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm not making it back. Okay, then. <laughs> Fire! <laughs> nope. No! Damn it! I screwed that one up. Well, if you if you miss the latch with Farco, right, you're immediately done. 
Oh, this one got cool music too. Honestly, this entire game got cool music. Nope. So what you saw right there was a so-called ledge cancel. Let's just pretend that I did it intentionally. But if you um, land on the ledge of like... On the e an edge cancel, I'm sorry, not ledge. Damn it, there are so many words similar to that one. <laughs> but if you land on the edge of something, then your character slides off. Because your you still got forward momentum. And your whatever the, the hell animation your character was doing just kind of vanishes. Which is nice. You can use this for illusions, you can use that for um, falling. Or attacks or something like anything really. It just turns lag into non-existence, but this is very difficult to do intentionally, and oftentimes it's just impossible. So, but it's something that's in this game, like so many things are. Nope. Oh, that's nice. Nope! <laughs> I meant to trade. I did, but I screwed it up. I was at a higher percentage than he. So why the hell not take him down with me? Oh. The clank. Okay, we got him off. Ah, there we go. He stalled for too long. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, we still fine, still fine. Oh, I'm totally trading. No! <laughs> I need to be more, 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 more patient. Oh fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. Mm. There are quite a few things where I really want to work on. I need to be more committed. Like if I, if I see him on the ground, I should just attack him immediately and not think about what is he gonna do next because right now there's not much he can do I should just kill him I need to hit my lasers which I I'm not doing that well with those I need to hit them better and also I need to implement wave dashing which I I still only do rarely it's so difficult to do it properly <laughs> the dash attack combos, they're real. I wonder if that's a real combo, actually. It might very well be. Like, there, there are combos which are just straight up, like, this is gonna hit every time. So, those are really rare, though. Like, but combos, like, they are in other fighting games. So, you just, like, jab, jab, something, right? But... These are... You see that? I'm not sure if that is an actual combo. Anything where you have to follow up, like manually, you have to predict where he's going, where he's... what he's doing. That is not really a combo. We call it combo, but honestly, it's more like a string of attacks. <laughs> God damn it. Stop it. Ow! Ow, girl! What did you do that for? <laughs> I know, I like the clanks. 
They kind of got a certain DVC feeling to them. Up. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Get shit on! Oh, yes! No! Ah, did you see that? That was cool! Damn it, you shine me. Boom! Oh! Look at that! Look at that! Up into the air you go. Oh, Moth. Oh, Moth. Wait, how long have you been doing? Oh, 20 minutes already, damn it. Oh, man. That's okay, hello there, Moth. Oops. Well, um, let's just blame that on Moth being Ember. Right? Right. Nope. Ah, it's difficult. The thing about Fox Recovery, it's actually got a really high priority. It breaks through a lot of moves. And hits hits you first. So you need to really time it well. Again, these space animals, they got invincible legs. Because according to original lore, which was later taken out, they actually got steel legs, like robot legs. They removed that lore later on, because apparently it's not kid-friendly enough or something, I don't know. But since they aren't real legs, like, you can't hurt them if you hit those legs. I mean, why would they give a shit? Oops! Damn it! Trying to be too fancy. Okay, got him. Boom! I'm getting better at it, though. Uh, no! Should not have gone for that. I'm not even sure if that would have killed if it had hit. Because he was at 0% after all. Ah, whatever. That's going to make it a little bit more interesting, at least. Oh, wow. Nice shine there. Oh, that works. Okay, then. So after a multitude of suicides, it's now time to put an end to this. Or maybe not. Well, maybe, maybe yes. But with another suicide. That didn't feel right. That didn't feel right. Okay, buddy. Damn it. Mia, stop it. God fucking hell. Seriously? Okay, fuck you. <laughs> Pokemon! No. Damn it. No, 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 no. Yeah, I should have. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wow. Okay, slightly lucky. Pokeball! Mr. Saturn! No! <laughs> we are never going to beat Marv. No. Okay. No. Here we go. Ike! I like Ike. 
So Ike is entirely different, because Ike does not have any projectiles at all, and Ike pretty much only got killing moves. Like, every move he's got, he's just super powerful. Okay. And... Boom! You see this? This was a very low percentage. And just straight up kills. And Ike does that to a lot of characters. And honestly, this right here, the neutral air, this one, is just super nice because it covers a huge ground and also deals a good amount of damage. And mostly it just kind of keeps you safe. It's not really that easy to approach Ike while he does that. Also, you can't mess with his recovery. <laughs> Boom! Baby! Get countered. Oh, bad news. Uh, nope! Psst, the cape. It turns you around, doesn't deal damage to you, though. Well, it does deal damage, but it doesn't give you hit stun, so... You can't just use that to, like... Cancel my recovery. It's silly. I don't like the cave. Got him. Uh, damn it! This is really not that great. Nice. Uh, I just need to get one of my other areas in. The neutral air is nice for racking up damage. Everything else kills. That's the thing about Ike. Pretty much every move kills. But not all of them. And the one that I use the most doesn't. No. Nope. So I also got other shit. Like he can like he can I don't know how to do it. But you you can use this right here to close distances. And um, you can actually act out of it somehow. I don't know how though. Like you can jump out of... Oh! Okay, I figured out how to jump. <laughs> no! How did that not counter? That should totally have counter. I'm not happy that that last one did not counter. Can you stop it? Hate Mario. There you go. Ah. ah that felt good. Okay, let's go then. No! No, not again! <laughs> I'm beating you this time. You're going down. Deep down beneath, dude. It's actually Fire Emblem versus Fire Emblem. That's kind of fun. Oh, man. Nope. God fucking hell, why did he not... I'm not going to beat this guy, am I? Let's see if he can't get some knees. Dream down. Okay. Nope. Look, I'm just here to get some knees. Ah! The problem with, with that is just that I need to play Captain Falcon to do it. And I don't know how to play Captain Falcon. Damn it! <laughs> this is so sad to watch, isn't it?
No, I wanted to grab you. Should maybe play him just like I do Ganondorf. Except, no. Oh, no, I had him. I should have just kept the ledge. Okay, so up into the air. And nope. And okay, keep him. Uh nope, you're still fine. Just need to get a knee. Just need to get a knee. I just need a knee! Uh, but on the upside we're actually not doing that bad, so. Oh, no! I need to keep the ledge. I need to just fuck it. I had him. Okay, i sorry. I forgot I had. I lost my double stun. No. I'm not letting you do that. I should have need him. I don't know, the, the, the elbow of the people, the people's elbow is also fine. Knee of justice, the people's elbow, elbow, you know, all of that is just cool. The kick of the falcon. The punch of the falcon. No! Damn it! <laughs> okay, come on. I just want one knee! Just one knee! Okay, keep running. Huh? Oh, nice. Mm. I just want one knee. Come on. I'm not giving up on this. Ah, uh, he's up in the air. The problem is he's actually deliberately playing to not give me that knee. Damn it! I don't know. I probably wouldn't have hit him, and then I would have died. And that would have been my last chance to get a knee. The problem with Mario is that he's at such a weird rate that you can combo him, just not at all. Nope. My Captain Falcon is. No! Captain Falcon is at a similarly weird rate where you can't just combo him perfectly with like every character ever. Damn it! No! I want to see you beat Marv. C come on. Oh? Damn it! Did he pick Mario just for this? Just so he could beat Marv? Look at that. Just use the use the football. And nope, nope, nope. Come on. Ah You can do it, buddy! Oh, there we go in. The fan. Oh up smashed up into the air, he flies. And the forward smash to finish him off. Sweet. And with that, we're gonna conclude today's episode of Smashing Brothers. I hope you enjoyed it. Okay. Okay, we're gonna do one more of this. We're not gonna conclude it yet. Look. If you want to do that, let's fucking do it. Well, we just unlocked Marv, and it was quite the hassle to do it with too, so... Okay. So these two are swordsmen. You cannot hit their swords, like, that's invincible. Oh, nope. But, uh, they, you know, they kind of got downsides too. Mostly because they, mostly they're, they're bad recovery, both of them.
damn it. <laughs> okay, apparently you cannot do that. I didn't know. I was not aware. Some characters can. I was can't. Oh, that should do it. Or maybe not. So, Roy is widely considered to be not the greatest character. Oh, shit. He's kind of like mid-tier. But there's one player out there called Zephlon who is really good at playing Roy. And he, seriously, he competes with the best players in the world. And he uses this mid-tier character. Which is really cool to see, you know. But that's actually not too rare on Smash. There's also like Axe, who's a melee player that uses Pikachu and is one of the best in the world. Nope, that's bad. Damn it! <laughs> okay, <laughs> with that embarrassment, we conclude today's episode. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you tomorrow.